Graves? What's up? Oh! Oh, Avery. Just assisting the litter around the cafe. <laughs> cafe. Cafe. Yeah, it looks like someone's been using this walkway as a trash dump. So they have. Do you think it's one of the shop owners around here? I know the culprit. The true matter is probably deal with its disposal. That's not our job. If you know who it is, make them do it. Regretfully, I don't believe we can stop him. He looks serious. I mean, I can't blame him. This is an eyesore and it's probably hurting business. What a jerk. Who is it? Nobody you know. Don't worry about it. Well, I guess we <laughs> I guess if he's not gonna stop, we shouldn't start cleaning it up. We should start cleaning it up. I'll help carry some of it. I roll up my hoodie sleeves and reach out to grab the rusty bike hand. Grave's hand. His fingers coiled tightly around my wrist so quickly I didn't even see him move. Don't touch it. His eyes hold an intense, stern glow as he stares as the stare bores into me. For just a moment, I feel that chill claw up my spine again. Oh, okay. Sorry. Forgive me. It's too dangerous to do this without the correct procedure. You haven't learned enough yet. This is a lot more complicated than just picking up trash, huh? Please, don't worry about it. I have to go to the bathroom. I gotta pee so bad. I'll be right back. Hello? Glad to see no one disappeared while I left. <laughs> Hopefully not. Suddenly you all just leave. Anyway. Uh, gotta take away my stabilize. I'd rather you focus on the cafe and leave this to me. Please don't worry about it. You're so opaque, I seriously don't get you at all. 
I've been hearing about that since I could speak. I've been hearing that since I could speak. I'm used to it by now. Or she'd just tell me straight up what's going on. Consider it a management problem. How's the job treating you? You do enjoy it here, yes? Well, maybe if I had a boss that told the truth, it'd be easier. No need to be contentious. I'm doing the best I can. Truly, I'm sorry for this mess, Avery. I'm not the one you should be apologizing to. Hello? Talk to the rest of the staff about that. Best case scenario, this will be dealt with soon. We can all forget about it. And if the best case doesn't happen, then we'll have to new bridge to cross. Well, you'd best head in. Wouldn't want to be late after all. You gonna write me up or something if I am? I don't think you need to after Finley got through with you for making her open by herself. Shoot, you're right. Well, later. Till then. There isn't much time until we open, so I hurry off to the cafe. Avery, there you are. I was starting to get worried. Sorry. I got sidetracked on the way here. I ran to Graves. I guess talking to the boss counts as work. No, it doesn't. Graves shouldn't keep hold of a topic if it... <laughs> Graves couldn't keep hold of a topic if it was stapled in to his hand. Dang! Every... Standing up! Yeah! We hardly got to work. I And I also think it was my tone, too, because I don't think... When I heard other people saying those lines, it was nearly as strict. <laughs> we hurriedly get, hurriedly get to work finishing a pre-open setup. Though it doesn't really matter because it's it's a slow morning. The first person to come through the door isn't even a customer. It's Graves. Oh, they have like tables on upstairs. They have like an actual cafe upstairs and then I think there's like seating around the room that's like a cat free table because they have like a cat play area that I think the cats normally sit in. Fancy meeting you here. You want some coffee? The usual? How are my audio levels by the way? Because my on OBS is saying like me talking is a lot louder than uh the desktop audio. So I can turn that down. Alright, turn myself up, hold on. Anyway. Hmm? Uh not right now, thank you. Please pay me no mind, I'll be in and out today. Maintenance work. Finally, the sink in the kitchen has been backing up something fierce lately. Thank you, Kiro. Not that kind of maintenance, my friend. Security improvements. He blows through the building and disappears through the back door as quickly as he arrived. Reese watches him go and takes a few wavering steps toward the door before deciding against it. I guess even Reese can't outboss the boss. Security improvements, huh? the heck is that supposed to mean? That was weird. Well, back to work, huh? Yeah. It's hard to focus on work when I can see Grave pacing back and forth in front of the big glass storefront. Luckily, it's a slow day, so I can excuse myself every so often to peek in on him. I think I just saw him bury something under a loose tile. At one point, I dip my head out to see what he's doing, and he's just standing there, staring at a wall, tracing a picture on it with his finger. He's making runes, dude! How are you, like, into magic and you don't know this? Brah? Come on. I'm sure he's doing it to look busy. <laughs> then I catch a glimpse of something, like light reflecting off a piece of metal on the wall itself. It flashes for a moment, then it's gone. Maybe I'm seeing things. Maybe he's doing... Something to the building. Something arcane, I guess. But if he is, why? 
Why is he suddenly so concerned with security? Is he setting like a magic anti-theft alarm or something? Or is it something more sinister? Yeah, I like this um music from the game. It's good. Yeah, it's I wasn't sure I'd like it, but um it was in a humble bundle. Um just a base one. So I was like, you know, I'd rather pay I think I paid like $2 and got like three games. Um, and I was like, I'll play Hot Cats. <laughs> I, I want to see what happens with Reese and everyone else, so. Yeah. Okay. I can't help but think of his weird behavior this morning. His focus on the rust piles. Something must be coming. Something as serious as the cat curse. And we haven't even gotten to the good stuff, okay? Okay, people. If he's just gonna leave us in the dark, I've got I've got to do something. It's time I finally talked to someone about magic, the book, the curse, everything. <gasps> this is now we get to see if they chose who we thought we we were going for. I'm sure. The good stuff. I know just who to start with, but it looks like he's on his way out. Where? It's the middle of the work day. I really need to talk to him. He's the only one I think might understand. <gasps> yes! Yes! Woo! Okay. Avery, shouldn't you be working? There's like nobody here. Do I need to assign you busy work? Oh, stop trying to act like a boss for a second. I have to talk to you. Look at his cutie! He loves fashion! I'm here for it. Can it wait? I'm gonna go discuss something with Graves. Do you know what he's doing? Of course. No, I mean like, do you know what he's really doing? I'm not sure I follow. His security arrangements don't involve any traditional anti-theft system. I think I know what's going on. I feel like he's staring into my soul somehow. I wish I could tell him, could tell what he's thinking. So let's talk, but not here. Okay. Come with me to the basement. <laughs> okay. This was my idea, but he's already claimed it as his. What a brat. Is there something down there? No, that's the point. Come on. How about you ask nicely? What? You're the one who wanted to talk. <laughs> Baka? I don't like you. <laughs> Not to the rude dude like you. Say please. I can just leave. I could too. My uncursed human self walking right down the road however I please. Oh, come on. Let's just talk about this and get it over with. He grabs the hood of my jacket and gives it a solid tug as he heads toward the basement stairs. Yeah! It's uh, finally decided that this is the route we're gonna go on. Oh, that's a strange way to pronounce, please. <laughs> Avery. Maybe now isn't the time to tease him. He's actually taking this seriously. All right, all right. Here we are among those rattlesnake skeletons, geodes, stuffed crows, and a bag of sugar. Just not, it's just one bag. Not really <laughs> what they have in the sentence I just read, but <laughs> bags of sugar. This is probably Graves' favorite room in the whole building. Do you think it's news to me that you broke the curse? You did it weeks ago. Huh? So you know how to do it? Well, no, I just know that you did it. What spells have you been studying? Where did you start learning? Don't tell me you just stumbled into it. Wait, wait. Back up. How do you know I've been studying magic? Witches can recognize other witches, Avery. You aren't very secretive. 
I saw you practicing an incantation on your break. 